welcome back to another weekly vlog. Um, let me tell y'all, this morning did not go as planned for me. I woke up late and my morning is just all thrown off. <laughs> it's I'm like super late. This is not like a 10, 15, 30 minute late. This is like almost an hour late of me getting up. And it's just completely throwing my morning off. I intended on waking up this morning, like doing a morning routine and all this stuff uh, for the vlog, but that didn't turn out the way I expected it to. Um, but uh, the boys and I just got out the house uh, probably about 15 minutes ago. I had to turn back around because I forgot my ring on the counter and I had to go back and get it. So um, right now I'm about to head to. <laughs> What's wrong? Gonna take the boys to school um, and head to work. And um, yeah, he's back there fussing because he can't hold both his tablets, y'all. Oh my goodness. But yeah, about to do that. I don't think I may be able to grab me anything for breakfast. So I did make me some green tea this morning and I brought an apple. So that'll be like my breakfast for the morning. And um, yeah, so I have to start my morning off. I, I hate that I started my week off like this because I'm not in like a bad mood that I started my morning off like late, but it does kind of throw me off. But um, I am going to redo myself tomorrow when I wake up and set my alarms again. So, I, cause I think my alarms like were kind of offset this morning which kind of threw it off too. And normally like my mom calls me at a certain time. So she didn't call me this morning. So that was like another thing that threw me off. So yeah, just all different things y'all. But um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm just throwing off this morning. But yeah, I'm gonna get ready to drop the boys off and I'll chat with y'all later on in the day. Say good morning. <coughs> Say good morning. Good morning. Yay! Y'all ready to get out for school? No, I take it as a no, you sleepy yet. <clears throat> Alright, so I just got done dropping the boys off in the school. <clears throat> and whew, I don't know why my throat is so raspy. Ooh, I don't think y'all look at me. <clears throat> okay, so I just got done dropping the boys off in school. Um, I drove past, <clears throat> oh my goodness. I drove past Starbucks, y'all, before I dropped them off. And that line was ridiculous. I was gonna stop by to get me some oatmeal. But I think I'll probably go to McDonald's to get an oatmeal instead. Cause I do have some time. It's 8:15, and luckily my job isn't that far from the school, so I'm able to like quickly go somewhere to grab something. So that's what I'm about to do. I'm about to um I'm about to go grab some oatmeal from McDonald's. Hopefully their line didn't pack up on me while I drop them off and then head to work um I was about to do something but yeah so really excited y'all um and like I said <coughs> I um 2022 was gonna be my year to like the weekly vlog not sure how that's gonna go um I've been doing you know <coughs> adding some things to my routine daily and it's like my life just keeps piling up but you know that's life if you want to have you know the life that you want to have you have to do what you have to do and stuff like that but, but yeah i started classes back this week um i'm working out working um taking care of the boys throughout the week so yeah y'all see all this madness that i deal with on a day-to-day -day basis um and yeah so anywho about to go ahead and stop by mcdonald's focus on this road because this traffic over here in this area is ridiculous because people don't know how they you know how to drive they don't know how to act and none of that stuff 
So, have to pay attention. So, I'll check back in later. And, yeah. Can I have your order? Um, yes, ma'am. I have the fruit and maple oatmeal. Alright, anything else for you? Um, and one hash brown, and that'll be all. <coughs> Thank you. You're welcome. <clears throat> yeah, I don't think I could have forgot the hash brown. Let me get my money out. My money out. Let's okay, just got to work. Quick thing um, before I walk in. It's like 8.36 and I'm about to get ready to walk into work. But um i am participating in 21 days of prayer and fasting super excited so i'll be documenting that throughout my weeks as well y'all um every day before i go into work i sit in my car i pray for like five or so minutes um just to get my day started it really helps and you can tell when god is like really um there with you and actually listening to you and he's carrying you along your way so i definitely suggest y'all just you know before you start your day say a quick prayer you know thank god for waking you up all that other good stuff um but yeah i really just wanted to come on here and tell y'all that before i walked into work uh prayer really is like the meat of everything the meat of your life like i realized that towards the end of 2021 and i told myself from now on this is what i'm gonna do it helps me it you know it's i'm i'm building this relationship with god this connection so y'all please try to do that as much as you can before you start your day because i promise you it'll make a world of difference but anyways about to get ready to get out the car get my stuff together so i can get my day started today's gonna be a great day it's monday hopefully these co-workers don't get on my nerves but listen we not gonna claim that so yeah about to get ready to go to work y'all i'll check back in with y'all later on i'm not sure if it'll be during my lunch time or whatever but i'll check back in bye for being so faithful so kind so loving so caring god we thank you that you've covered us god even the moments in our lives where we didn't put you first the moments in our lives that we didn't want to put you first. God, I thank you that you remain the same with us. You never changed, God. You never gave up on us. So, Lord, we pray against every distraction right now that tries to prevent us from putting you first, God. So, we pray against the distraction of insecurity. All right, y'all. So, I've been home for a minute. Just got done with 21 Days of Prayer, watching the live video, and literally just got done cooking as well. I normally don't get done kicking around seven o'clock but steven had me to fix up the game before i came in so um just got done cooking i made some asparagus um the cracker barrel macaroni and cheese steak and garlic bread so that's our dinner for tonight i'm about to go upstairs with them normally we eat downstairs but we're gonna watch the game the alabama and georgia game upstairs in our loft area so i'm about to go up there the boys already have their food and um we're gonna watch the game eat some good food uh i'll probably start on well i can't start on my homework right now because i have to get um wait on my textbook to come i ordered it late because i thought it was gonna be like an online thing but it's a physical textbook so i have to wait till that comes but i'll probably do like the other discussion board and start on some premarital counseling paperwork the pastor sent us and stuff like that so about to get all that done after I get done eating and chill for the rest of the evening because well I don't have to work tomorrow which is really exciting <laughs> because I have to be home for um our appliance repair but I'll talk about that later let me go ahead and take our food upstairs but your girl is hungry and I'm sure Steven is and I don't want our food to get cold because it is good well, it's only crucial review here Let's see if it Stands where they take the points off the board here. Another look. Because I want to show you something because I want you to watch 95 Wyatt, who looked like his head was off sides, which would have negated the play completely. It would have been a free play and a five yard penalty. Good morning. I am currently about to take the boys to school. Um, I'm out today, or at least I call out today because 
I have to get my dryer service this morning because it's not been working and that's been a little annoying to me because I can't do like laundry when I want to do it because my dryer is not working. So um, they'll be coming sometime this morning. Uh, hopefully by the time I come back, even though Steven is home, but he's asleep and I don't think he goes to work till this afternoon. So, um, yeah, so that is what I'm doing today so far. And I'm going to, oh, the sun is something else. But, um, that is all that I'm doing today. Uh, I'm going to try to work on a little class work. Um, and I'm going to the gym this evening uh, after I pick up the boys from school. So I go to my mom's house. Um, I've been working out for the past week. Going to the gym. And I'm just, I'm just going to try to keep that steady uh, from here on out. So I have to keep that moment going. But uh, I might grab me something to eat on the way back home. Might not. Just all the pans um, on how I feel and how my mind cook down a But yeah. Good morning. And Steeman is asleep. Y'all, and let me tell you, this little boy will be knocked out while I'm getting him dressed. Um, while I am um, putting him in the car. That little boy is a sleepy head. He does not wake up. If he don't go to sleep on time at night, he will not wake up and I'll have to get him dressed while he's asleep. And it normally it's pretty easy, but Boy, just a sleepy head. I'm like, dude, it's time to go to school. So I'm at Jack's. I'm about to grab some breakfast before I go back home. Um, because I don't feel like cooking anything. <laughs> My, I don't feel like giving myself any breakfast. So I normally like if I, I mean, and if I got up early enough to before work and stuff i would cook myself breakfast every day but the way my life is set up that don't happen so i'm about to pick me something up from jack's um get steven something to eat as well um because he's at home and he i don't like i said i don't, I don't think he go to work till like noon but he'll probably be up a little early for him to snack on his breakfast sandwich and stuff like that. So, um, yeah. I don't know why I keep saying, um, 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 um. That's what I said I'm going to control because, oh my goodness, um annoys me when it comes out my mouth or anybody else's. So I need to control saying, um, um, um. Um, and I think Ed, that's like everybody's habit. And smacking my lips. Smack my lips. That's annoying. <laughs> I know if it's annoying to me, it's annoying to y'all. But, uh, yeah. But, so, yeah. Oh. <clears throat> Let me, um. Y'all, I had to get this Fubo app for Steven to watch the game last night, but I need to cancel that bad boy because I am not about to pay $65 a month when I pay for Hulu, Amazon, Netflix. That's like 65 bucks already right there. I'm gonna pay $65 for no Fubo and I'm not even gonna watch it. Mix with a uh, vanilla iced coffee and a um a number five instead of hash browns. Can I get cheese grits with the vanilla iced coffee? Everything else? That's all. Send it around. Dang, homegirl did not even let me get a chance to get to the speaker. Oh my goodness, like. Don't let it be that day. Don't let it be that day. So yeah, um, about to go ahead and 
I, was, I don't even know what I was talking about. She literally like threw me off. Cause really, she did not even let me get to the speaker good enough for me, <laughs> for me to even look at the menu. I mean, even though I knew what I wanted, she did not give me a chance to like get to the speaker good enough. Like, jeez, girl. Oh my goodness, but yeah. Okay, so <clears throat> oh goodness, excuse me. I just woke up and took a shower. Um, I slept all morning, me and Steven, until he got up for work. And um, I needed that little sleep. It was well needed. I'm glad I took a nap because any other time I'll probably be doing, a, doing something, moving around, yada, yada, yada. So this time around, I actually took a nap. And um had a good get down. Had a good nap too. Um just finished cleaning up me some food. I'm about to eat that. It's like 145. Well, 138. It's 138. So I'll probably be able to pick up the boys in the next 30, 40 minutes or so. So I could be so I could be traffic going to my mom's house because I have to drop them off. And then I'll probably I don't know, my workout is until 545, so I'll probably hang out at her house for a little bit. I don't know, not sure yet, but definitely gonna pick them up a little early so I can be traffic. Uh, my dryer is working. Let me tell y'all, I was so excited this morning because y'all know, if y'all wash clothes and y'all wash clothes like I do, I, like, I'm, like, really irritated and depressed in my appliances are not working the way they should or if I'm without and you know you hate bothering people or going to other people's houses to carry all those clothes to go wash your clothes and dry your clothes and this that and third so I am so happy my dryer is working I am drying about to dry two loads that I had washed yesterday um and I'll probably wash another load tonight uh, just so I could I won't have that much to wash by the end of the week um, hopefully my textbook arrives by tomorrow so I can start on my classwork too y'all because I hate I mean I hate the fact that I ordered my textbook late but I also didn't know which one I had to actually get until he posted the class on my blackboard so oh my goodness oh I thought that was a freaking rip in my chair somebody was gonna get it but yeah so about to go eat my food y'all and Hurry up and pick up the boys. So, come on, buddy. Mm -mm. Ooh. Alright guys, so I brought them to my mom's neighborhood playground so they can play a little before we go to her house. Um, it's a nice little playground that they have over here. Hey! Say hey! Hey! Wanna get on a swing? Wanna get on a swing, Steve Man? Yeah. You wanna get on a slide? You wanna get on a swing? Yeah. Okay, come on, let's get on a swing. Say, come on, buddy. Come on. Come on. Come on. Get off the little man. Say, cheese. Hold on. Look, 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 look. Still fun. Good job, buddy. You want to get out? Hold on, but hold on, but mama get you, mama get you. I just got, oh, just pulled up to the parking lot, um, to the gym for my workout this evening. Um, the workout doesn't start until 5:45, and it's 5:10, so I'm pretty early. Um, okay, yeah, it's pretty early. Um. 
I left my mom with the boys or left the boys with my mom. Um, normally, my mom would pick them up if I'm at work, but I was off today, so we went straight there, took them to the park, and um, let them play for a little bit, and then went to her home and chilled out for a second before I headed here. So I'm here now, and I'm ready to get this workout over with, to be honest, because I'm ready to go back home <laughs> and chill out um, to see what um, type of work I can do for class and um also to participate in um 21 days of prayer so that's where i'm kind of at right now but anyways i um i ate something before i left the house earlier to pick up the boys i had um my leftover steak and asparagus for lunch um and i had a little snack at my mama's house what did i have i had some sauce meat and y'all haven't eaten pork in like a long time but south meat that was like just calling my name so i had a little a little piece of that just a little piece with some crackers and um yeah y'all i can't eat sweets i'm cutting out sweets and like juices out of my um i'm fasting that for my 21 days so only and also to like benefit because i haven't been i'm trying to work out trying to you know get healthier eat healthier um become fit and all that stuff so i have to cut out things in my diet that it's not good for me so it's been going good so far um with everything but when you go to someone's house and all they have is like sweets and sugars and all that stuff it's like uh, it's not too tempting right now but and I, i've been really good with like disciplining myself so kudos to me but um i think i'm just trying to chill out right now until we go until i go in the gym listen to some music we'll get some tiktoks get on instagram just kind of waste time and then i'll probably head in there probably about like 5 35 and go ahead and stretch and stuff like that to get my warm uh warm up in and yeah so, um, just finished with my workout. It was really good. Y'all, my mama in this, so I'm driving my mama's car. And her in this plastic, I swear. Old folks love to keep plastic on their stuff, boy. Jeez, it's all in my way. But, um, yeah, just got done with my workout. And about to get ready to head home. Oh, but, but first, I gotta fix my protein shake. Leaving the gym. I had to take Steven to let him know I was leaving. So, you know, I'm headed home. But, um, yeah, I got a protein shake. I carry my almond milk in my little, um, cooler canteen canister thingy. And Steven bought this good freaking um good um protein shake mix. That's vanilla flavor and y'all it is so freaking good. So good. I put mine in the Ziploc bag because the jar is like really huge and Of course, I can't carry a big jar around. <clears throat> but, y'all, I'm really excited about this fitness journey that I'm going on. I'm, after I get done with this boot camp, I'm going to actually join the gym and start, like, the personal training and stuff or the training and whatnot to reach my goals. Um, I told myself if I get the goal, get to the goal that I want to be at and stuff like that, I... Steven and I will reward ourselves with a trip to the beach. So that's, you know, I'm pushing myself to kind of, you know, keep working out, keep being consistent and all that stuff. So eating right, all that. So really excited, really excited about, you know, my goals and how I'm, how I'm reaching them and things like that. Oh, that is so good. Oh my goodness. And it's so cold.
it's a little, it's a little powder chunks in there, but other than that, y'all, it's so good, it's so cold. But yeah, about to get ready to get uh, picked up the boys from my mom's house and go eat a little dinner. Then I'm gonna do my 21 days of prayer, check on some homework. Uh, hopefully my textbook comes tomorrow. I've been saying this all since the beginning of the week, so. All right, y'all. Uh, I think this is like my first time vlogging for the day today. Um, it's five o'clock and I just got off of work. Literally just got to my car. And I don't know, today y'all has been like super weird. Like the vibe for me has been very weird. It's been off a little bit today. It's been okay. It's been an okay day today, but today's just been feeling like super, super weird. Um, like <laughs> I wanted to freaking quit my job today. Like that's how I, I honestly felt. Like y'all do not understand how bad I hate my job. <laughs> and it's like oh my goodness whatever but today was just like really awkward for me like towards the end of the day like after my lunch break it was just like really awkward but once like 4 58 hit i gather my things and i get ready to go clock out because i, I literally run out of that place <laughs> literally but anyways um today um like i said i don't know i don't know just today was just like really weird but right now um i'm about to head to go pick up the boys steven and i had to meet with the um meet at the venue with for the wedding with um the wedding coordinator um, to go over details for the wedding uh, as far as like decorations and um, cake and scheduling tastings and all this stuff so really excited about that because so we finally get to like talk details so um, I don't think this particular blog or this particular like um, a part of the wedding vlog series i have started that though i haven't posted anything yet because i'm waiting to vlog for my next one once i vlog my second um video i'll uh, post the first one that is already edited it's just ready for me to post that's all it's ready to go so i got content coming y'all way i told y'all i wasn't playing with y'all this year so i'm just gonna try to stay fully committed and stay like really consistent with posting as much content as I can um so yeah but we have to meet there at six Steven is at work but um he'll be able to make time to come and sit with us to go over those details and stuff Woo! so yeah really excited really really excited to see what we get accomplished today um I think tonight it depends it depends on what time we get home because i may do some homework or i may do it tomorrow but i'm gonna start writing out um envelopes and stuff for the save the dates we got those in i gotta show y'all those and i think that part will be part of the wedding vlog i'm not sure i'm not sure yet i don't know or it just may be a part of this vlog whatever it's gonna be part of a vlog but yeah so i think i'm gonna do that tonight i gotta buy some more stamps so i gotta remember to do that tomorrow because i meant to do that yesterday but i overslept and didn't intend on sleeping that long yesterday so yeah that's where we're at right now um i'm going to i'm not going to cook tonight either because like i said we may get home like late not super late but late enough for me not wanting to cook so i'm not going to cook tonight either i'll eat some um uh, beef stew that
that was left over. Or I might pick the boys some uh boys and I something up to eat. Um so yeah, y'all. I just like really y'all like to be completely honest, I feel really like I don't know, like my whole mood has been down, but I've been praying throughout the day and talking to God throughout the day because that's what kind of helps me get me back in the mood or in the groove of whatever's going on. But, y'all, I don't know. It's been so weird today. Like, mmm. But, anywho. Hey, y'all. Happy Friday. Happy Friday. Happy Friday. Y'all, I didn't vlog any yesterday. Um... I don't think I, I don't think I even thought to pick up the camera yesterday, but it's Friday, it's Friday, it's Friday, and I'm so excited. End of the work week, so I'm gonna knock this day out today. The last couple of days have been like a little off and awkward, and I don't know, like I don't, I don't know where it came from. It just came out of nowhere. But anywho, um. Today's Friday. I'm so excited for the weekend. Um, tomorrow, <clears throat> tomorrow, Steven and I are going to see Cat Williams. So I'm super excited about that. I don't know if I'm, I think I'm going to end the vlog tomorrow. So yeah, y'all get to see all that good prep of getting ready and things like that. But yeah, yesterday I went to the gym, went to work, um, went to work out. And that was pretty much it today will be a pretty smooth well today i got some things to do for real after work i gotta do laundry and stuff today y'all finally got my dryer up and running so i gotta uh finish like my laundry and um i gotta finish my homework so that why i have to do it tomorrow and that is pretty much it and i gotta start working on these save the dates i gotta buy some stamps and start addressing those envelopes and stuff like that so i got quite a few stuff to do this weekend um to like and i gotta clean the house y'all our house it's not like dirty but it's not clean to my liking so i really need to clean the house the boys are gonna be with my um with their grandma this weekend so i'll be able to clean the house the way i want to um in peace without them pulling out stuff in the process of me cleaning <laughs> so um yeah i got like kind of like a busy weekend i i guess i'm not sure if it's like really considered busy but that's pretty much where i'm at right now at the week it's been a pretty good week so far though i really can't complain or anything like that <clears throat> so everything's been cool Hey y'all, happy Friday. So, Saturday, oh my goodness, I said Friday. Why am I going backwards? So, y'all, it's Saturday. Um, I already started my day today. Started it really early because I had to, um, I had to, I went to work out and then I um, ended up going to the mall and I just did not pick up the camera any this morning. It's like three o'clock now, and I'm just now getting my cleaning started. I was supposed to do this a long time ago after workouts, but things got delayed. So, about to like really try to like clean, clean um, from our room to the kitchen to the bathroom. I'm only gonna do downstairs today. That's all I have the energy for. Workout took me out. So, um, yeah, I guess y'all can watch me clean up. And this evening, I'm going, um, Steven and I are going to the Cat Williams show. So, that's why I'm trying to go ahead and clean up. So, I, hopefully I can get like a 30 minute hour nap, maybe, possibly, not sure. But, yeah, I'm about to go ahead and start cleaning and y'all can watch me. And also, disclaimer, my room is really a mess at the moment. So, um... Excuse it. That's why I'm cleaning up. It's normally not this messy. The last couple of weeks have been crazy hectic, so I haven't been able to like keep our room straight or anything like that. So, with oh, the boys bringing toys in here and stuff, it's a whole nother story. So.
Now y'all, as y'all know, I just you literally cleaned up the room. And here he come trying to find a freaking outfit and have all these clothes out on the bed after I already straightened up. Come on. Put it on the floor, it's gonna get back to do it. Yeah, this is how ignorant people are. Get that out of my face. No, because I need to show people. I need to show people how rude you are. Now, why would you mess? Now, you know I don't like my pillows messed up. Fix it, bitch. All right, get back. I will, if you fix it, bitch. Thank you. It's sloppy. Right, but, y'all, I just finished cleaning the bathroom. Well, I got to do the floor, but I'm satisfied right now. After this, I'm going to go wipe down the kitchen, vacuum. The rug in the living room, back in aisle floor, and faux clothes. So that's where I'm at right now, y'all. Again, yeah, that's where I'm at. So I just had to show y'all how rude people really are in this household. They just don't know how to act, and they don't respect the fact that I just cleaned up this whole bed and made it meet to my liking. And he just really disrupted it. No. All right, y'all. So we are down here at the BJCC for the um the show, and they're not letting us in right now. So we about to go grab something to eat, cause we ate all day. He's been trying to starve me all day, y'all. And let me tell y'all, <laughs> he don't love me. I gotta tell y'all, y'all gotta call child services, cause he don't love me. But anyways, yeah, your girl hungry, so um, we got to go grab something to eat. It's cold out here. It's raining just a little bit. I couldn't find my umbrella before we left, and I knew I had it in the car, but I don't know where it disappeared to, so I'm without it. But yeah, excited for the evening. We should just went straight on down. Oh shit. I'm so happy to be here, you guys. I'm so happy to be here in front of y'all and you see y'all out looking all good and so excited. It just warms my motherfucking heart for real. And it took us a long, long road to get back here on these stages in front of you guys, you know? We went through a lot, all of us. This fucking quarantine. Who thought, when they got married, that there would come a day where you would be locked the fuck up for 24 motherfucking hours a day for a year and a half fucking straight? Nowhere to go. Nowhere to go outside. Friends in the industry, my brothers been my brothers, name niggas, they don't kill me, I 